Oh, here is this uh, Yi Long, Yi Long, however you pronounce it, uh, Gorilla Squonk uh, mod. So, here is what's wrong with it. I can see, let Hmm, yeah, it's fun. It's crooked as hell. <laughs> Nothing sits flush on top of this mud, and it has a big, big gap there. And yeah. And yeah. Magnet keeps coming loose, so. Uh, here's one. I'm just gonna put it there for. Meanwhile, and then for inside the squonk bottle, it's fine, but it needs to be the hose needs to be a lot longer so it can reach the bottom of the bottle and you can pull it up properly so you don't get any false air into this. Um, into this ma uh, the squon when you squonk so between the atomizer and um, five ten connection on the bottle that uh, you don't want uh, any air between there so it's squonk less efficiently but yeah and here's the worst part uh, the the contacts it they are horrible it's probably some of the it's it is the worst contact I've seen in a Mac mod uh, ever, and it's the worst uh, put together uh, that I have uh, owned personally in my life. So the, the engraving on the side and uh, on the bottom, uh, bottom uh, is is fine, but. Um, uh, they took they took their time on that, but to not get it straight or to leave the, the contact shitty like this, um, they are dirty and oxidized, and uh, they look like they've been cut by a 12-year-old kid uh, with just scissors. So I'm sorry about my camera trying to focus. It's just it's not the best camera I'm using Tr I'm trying to just get this video out because my pictures as a you can just see it's sharp edges all over uh, the contacts that cut it here's the two battery after just I, I can't even use it because it's not safe I've wasted two good pairs of VTC 5A's uh, on this um, piece of crap uh, that's not uh, as promised you can see they do tears up the insulators and the uh, wrap uh, of the mud so, yeah I need to re-wrap those so and uh, you need to pull, have a to make like an improvised pull tab because uh, yeah if, if not uh, <laughs> you won't get you have to take the bottle out or to even have try to get the battery back out so there should be a strap or they should just make flat contact uh, with good uh, flat con connection on both uh, positive and negative and so it makes solid connection just for the best performance as possible so let me push do this uh, even though I don't want to do it because it's fucking stupid but let me try to show you what's happening here You see that? It's bridging the negative and the positive. 
So if your rapper is gone, is just remotely ruined uh, there or the insulator, you you might have an explosion, and with the FDA and um, TPD and everything we are going through uh, now, we don't need any more smud exploding in people's uh, hands or faces or whatever it, it should be. So, and with squonking coming, becoming so popular, this company needs to take responsibility and replace every box that has these problems especially the safety problems if the door is a bit crooked yeah you expect uh, some flaws in the uh, mud uh, m m that's mass produced but the f yeah it needs to be safe and now it's prom we don't even know how many upgrades that updates that you done on these mods so they need to mark the revisions also so v1 revision one two three four five whatever revision now apparently this mod has silver plating and a spring loaded uh, 510 uh, connection so i don't know what revision that will be so yeah that should be marked so the customer know which updated version updated version isn't good enough uh, as if it's more than one updated version so yeah and then it's to the performance of the mod which is just appalling this is a full char fully charged VTC 5A where did I put my um, There this is a 0 0.14 or 0 0.15 um, ohm um, uh, dual uh, parallel uh, no, dual um, fused clappings I believe so I'm pulling the button I'm pulling the button, pulling the button, and nothing's happening. So let me try and screw it a little tighter. Yeah, it it's just it's just performing horrible. And it's keep cutting my battery. I don't even feel safe using this fucking mud. So this should you shouldn't be scared to take your battery in and out of a device ever. So yeah, that's it. 